This video is brought to you by Artlist. All right, everyone, the Iceland 2023 trip is officially live right now. You can go to the link in the description to get all the information, check out the itinerary and reserve a spot. There should be early bird spots left so you can get a discount on the trip price. It'll take place February 10th through February 17th, 2023. And in case you missed the announcement in my last video, this trip is jam packed with a ton of fun activities. We're going to the Blue Lagoon, two national parks, hopefully seeing the Northern Lights, we're going to the Great Geyser, we're going to waterfalls, we're going to hot springs, we're doing a geothermal bath, we're going to a glacier, we're doing a coastal walk and more. And then of course, plenty of photography throughout the whole trip. However, you don't have to be interested in photography to come. This will just be a fun adventure and a fun exploration of Iceland. We'd love to have you join no matter who you are, no matter where you're from, and no matter what your interests are. That being said, I will be doing a photography workshop one of the nights where we'll be doing some long exposures on film in Iceland and I'll be walking you through my process of how I shoot long exposures at night on film. So that'll be a lot of fun. This trip is going to be absolutely epic and I'd love to have you join. If you have any questions or concerns, you can of course leave me a comment or shoot me a DM on Instagram. But like I said, all the information is available via that link in the description. You can go there to reserve your spot. February 10th through February 17th, 2023. I will see you guys in Iceland. Now getting into today's video, I am super excited to share it with you guys because honestly, it's probably some of my favorite video and photos I've ever captured in my entire life. I was blessed with the most beautiful day of hiking I've ever had. I went up to Mount Baker, Washington to snowshoe to a place called Artist Point. Right off the bat, got there at 7 a.m. and the blue hour was the most insane thing I've ever seen. These deep blue, gorgeous hues throughout the whole morning. So I bagged my idea of starting my hike right away and actually just kind of walked around the ski area for a little bit to take advantage of that light. Didn't get a lot of video clips because I was just so focused on taking those pictures. But it was about 10 degrees when I pulled up, so I was definitely freezing after about an hour of shooting at the base area. I went and sat in my car for a while to get my core temperature back online and once 9 a.m. came rolling around, I decided to start my hike up to Artist Point where the weather just kept getting better and the views just kept getting more beautiful. Hope you guys enjoy today's video.
Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. I definitely enjoyed the hike. And while I feel like the footage was some of the best that I've gotten in a long time and the pictures were some of my favorites that I've taken recently, trust me when I say it still doesn't do the whole experience justice. Okay, so if you ever get the opportunity to do a snowshoe like that up in the mountains, up to a snowy peak, I highly, highly recommend doing so because I've done a lot of backpacking and a lot of hiking during the summer, but seeing those mountains covered in snow like that and being up there and immersing yourself in that type of terrain, it's a completely different experience and it really takes your breath away. So I hope everybody gets the opportunity to do something like that at one point in their life. But uh, yeah, this was one of the funnest days I've had in a really, really long time. So before we go, last reminder, Iceland trip live right now, link and all the information's in the description, head over there, reserve your spot, see what we're up to. I'd love to see you in Iceland, February, 2023. And lastly, I'd like to thank today's sponsor, which is Artlist. All right, guys, I'm not going to lie. I didn't even have to script this narration. That's how easy it is for me to talk about Artlist and all the great things they have to offer. And speaking of Artlist offering great things, they're offering a new plan. So before it was the unlimited plan with 16, 17 bucks a month billed yearly, and it had one license that covered everything. But now they have a personal plan, and this is tailored more towards social media creators. So if you're making videos on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, if you're doing the TikTok jazz and you're making videos and you need music, Artlist has you covered with the personal plan because it's a fraction of the price of the unlimited plan and the license covers all the social media platforms. And it's billed in two ways. You can either have it still billed yearly at about nine, 10 bucks a month, or you can have it billed monthly now at 15 bucks a month. So this makes it much more accessible for young filmmakers, for young content creators, or if you're just looking to make videos on a budget and you need some quality, royalty-free music, Artlist's personal plan has you covered. And the best part is the personal plan still has the entire music and sound effects library available to use. So if you're interested in signing up for Artlist, check out the link in the description where you can get a bonus two months for free. Guys, thanks for tuning in to this week's video. I will catch you next week. Peace.